All right, so there's the records from the previous match. Uh, Wakamoto Oharu has Ura tomorrow, and uh, Kotonowaka has Tobi Zaru tomorrow. So Wakamoto Oharu getting the job done today to go to 6-2. and two. two more wins for him is Kachikoshi, but he's got his eye on a much bigger prize than that. These two men, though, that would be a blessing, Akachikoshi, because both, you know, uh, one has two wins and one has one win. So Midori Fuji uh, would have to struggle mightily, I think, to get back to a seven, I mean, an eight and seven record. Uh, but he, you know, there's a big match here for him because there'll at least be a lot of envelopes involved and sponsor money because it is the final match of the day. Kirishima came back from the injury trying to get eight wins, so we'll see. Currently, he's basically two and five, uh, just one better than Midori Fuji. Uh, but, you know, he, he did lose yesterday to Matakeyumi, so we don't want to say it's an easy win for him today. Because I kind of made that mistake yesterday, thinking it would be, and it didn't. So, uh, yeah, we'll see what the smaller man in the reddish orange i need another look at his mawashi there are we focused let me try okay i think it's abema sometimes their cameras sort of focus in and out i think it plays a little bit of havoc with my ipad focusing but uh yeah uh i just don't have that much more to say about this matchup. Um, unfortunately, you know, the last match of the day is rarely going to be the most exciting match that you're going to see that day. But you got to have it, right? You want to see what's happening with the Ozeki. And, uh, yeah, look down in the description if you want links. Uh, links for the merchandise. Links for the contest standings page. Uh, lots of links if you're new to Sumo. And I know a bunch of you are. Um, you know, check out some of the links down below. There's... Uh, Sumopedia, and there's a glossary page where you can learn a lot of the words, and just helpful links if you're sort of learning Sumo and brand new. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking that's a new Mawashi for Midori Fuji. I don't think he was wearing that color uh, earlier in the tournament. You guys let me know. Uh, and it looks bright and shiny, like it hasn't really been worn that much. So uh, maybe he's trying to change his luck. With a change of color. Somebody asked me the other day, like, why do they change their names? Like, why did Kiribayama become Kirishima? And, and there's all kinds of different reasons. It usually uh, a name change goes hand in hand with a promotion to a higher rank, which is what Hakuoho did when he met, entered the top division. He changed um, his stablemate, uh, Kawazo Ka Kawazoi, is that how you said it? Is now Kiho. And he changed when he went from Makushita to Jurio. Okay, oh. そして今度は左手を ロジノスケが止めました。霧島の回しですか。Dude, 
もう仕立てだけでねこの手の仕立ての取り方で変わると決められるので、はい、さっきね霧島がねあのまあ今固定で抱え込んでるんですよ、はい、であのね喉輪で So this happens sometimes, you know, they want to avoid any kind of a malfunction of the wardrobe, as it were. And this is the guy who famously did this during a Terra no Fuji match, was it? And really altered the, the match by calling that. And so now they're going to go out and help him, which is good, because he is struggling. And they're supposed to freeze in place, like you're playing freeze tag or something. And not really move or adjust their grip or you know where their their hands are.、Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know. Okay, okay, maybe. And、uh, yep, this is unusual, but it happens from time to time. So interesting for some of you, maybe the first time you're seeing this. Okay. So he'll slap them both and restart the match. Ah, so now it's high time. あ今確認してるビデオスってちょっと審判の方が話してるのであそうですね佐藤方が親方、はい、でビデオで見ながらあの手の位置と体の位置確認してます and they're checking to make sure they're in the, the right place 両手に指示してます佐藤方親方佐藤方親方ミニスキに指示しましたこれは下手の位置ですか、うん立てもね、取り方によってはね、親指通すと通さないで全然違いますからね。はい。うん、有利か不利になる。さあ、再開です。All right, we started again. A little bit of a breather there, and now we're off. この深い位置ではどうでしょうか。うん、投げ打つ。仕立て、振っていく。残した大関霧島。He got him. Oh, man. They were saying how it's a very long match if you add up the two parts,、um, you know, any way you slice it. But a lot of movement and、uh, some good technique, and you got to give it to Midori Fuji, man. He didn't give up.、Uh, And Kiribayama, what, what can you say at this point? You know, two, a two and six record basically. And,、uh, you know, I think he should have just stayed out of the tournament and,、uh, you know, recuperated.、Uh, he's obviously, I think somebody mentioned yesterday in the comments, you know, you could see him wincing、uh, in pain when Matakeyumi went in and was attacking, you know, the area where his rib is injured. And,、uh, you know, he's still doing his best out here. He's, you know, you got to give him all credit. He's working hard to try to get that win, Kirishima, and, and just can't get it. And,、uh, yeah, I don't know what's better optics for, you know, the Ozeki there、uh, to have just stayed out of the tournament and not had anybody in those top two slots. I think part of it maybe was even pressure, possibly, from people to be like, hey, we need somebody. In the Ozeki Yokozuna slot to be in the tournament, can you come back?、Uh, but you know, we'll never know if, if that conversation was had or not. But uh, yeah, uh, just not looking good. And Midori Fuji, there you go, staving off Maki Koshi with a second win. 
So good for him. And like I said, he got rewarded. You didn't see it on camera, but he got rewarded with a lot of envelopes because it was the final match of the day. There is the end of the bow twirling. So now the majority of people will stand up and start to head for the exits out into the hot, hot, hot Nagoya weather. Hot and humid, unfortunately. Uh, but there you go. Okay, so thank you for watching day eight with me. I will be back full coverage tomorrow. And uh, feel free to uh, leave a comment. Is there a matchup on day nine you really want to see? Uh, let me know in the comments, and I will do my best to oblige. Uh, maybe check in on Jurio. I haven't really been that interested in what's been happening down there, to be honest. Uh, uh, but, yeah, maybe a Jurio match or two. You never know. We'll see what's going on down there. Three-way leaderboard here in the top division with Hoshoru, Nishikigi, and Hokuto Fuji. So, of course, I'll have all of their matches for you tomorrow. Okay, see you then guys. Oh, a little bit more of the replay. And uh like I said, you know, if he changed that Mawashi because he wanted to change his luck, uh it certainly worked today and he got a nice win over the Ozeki to finish off day 8. Okay, come on back. See you tomorrow.